Welcome back. A Tucson woman struggling to get by says the court system unlawfully tried to charge her interest on an outstanding fine. And as our investigative team found out, it was a potential mistake that could have cost her thousands of dollars. Jacqueline Sanchez thought she had finally gotten a break. She was working two jobs, getting ready to go back to school and had hopes that the sale of her property would ease her financial situation. Then court officials told her they'd be taking a big chunk of the money. It caught me so off guard, it kind of pulled the rug out from under me. Sanchez says she doesn't have an issue with Pima County Superior Court taking the 5000 she owed for an outstanding fine. Her issue is with the 10% interest the court added on, an amount that came to nearly $2,000. This is wrong. Like, how can you guys just take all of this money all at once. A Pima County judge found a problem with the interest amount too. Court records show the judge gave Sanchez her money back after ruling that Pima County had no legal basis to collect the interest because officials never specified when the interest was supposed to start. I felt betrayed by the system. Um, I also felt like it was a time to rally we contacted Pima County about the judge's decision, and while a spokesperson said the court doesn't comment on judges' rulings, Sanchez is worried that what happened to her happened to others. If they were taxing me 10%, what about the other people that are even in my position and potentially worse off? The financial hardship was just incredible. Now, Arizona law does allow courts to charge interest, but in this case, because there wasn't a start date for that interest, the judge didn't allow it. Now, if you have a story you'd like us to investigate, email us at investigators at kvoa.com or call 520-955-4444.